Uh, this gentleman has uh, ADS. It's a it's a mild case, but we can you can see here the the skin is the skin's very elastic, but you don't have any other any other symptoms. But, but uh, he's had wrist pain for the last uh, last twelve months. He had bilateral wrist pain. Now just grip this for me. Just move it up and down for me. A little bit painful? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Just come around here for me. And just put the wrist over here. And bring it up here for me. And bring it down. Right down. Good. Just move it a bit further over. Bring it right up. And down. And up. And down. Yeah, just keep doing that. With a connective tissue disease like this, you find that the uh, probe receptors don't work very effectively. So we're stimulating these now, and you should find this you know, quite a quite a pronounced difference after the treatment. So what we're doing here is an instrumented myofascial release, and uh, we'll just put a little bit of uh, a bit of cream on here. Nice and light, but unlike a lot of uh, cases of EDS, uh, there's no uh, problem with bruising, so we can we can use the uh, ISTM instrument. On it, just move your wrist up and down for me. Yeah, and down. Good, nice and easy. That's fine. We'll just relax. Now let's uh, just do a little bit, a little bit more detailed work around here, and the pain's fairly localized there. To work. Just across the retinaculum of the of the wrist, which is a, a thickening of the deep deep layer of fascia, and it's richer than the, the richer in uh, sensory innovation than the, the rest of the deep fascia. I right, just come around here again, and just lift this up again, and do the same action again. Much better. Yeah. Okay, thanks.